All right, guys, welcome back. So today we're going to be jumping back in, playing some more of the Rise of the Ronin. And um, yeah, last episode, it, it, there was a lot of misconception going around, especially even me, like when, when jumping into the first episode of this game, I, I expected more story driven, like Ghost of Tsushima style game, not that caliber of game, but that style of game. Um, and it actually ended up being more like a, like Sekiro, like Sekiro. Um, it's, it's a souls like, um, not as hard as many of the souls likes we've played, but, uh, right now it's kind of in that in between stage of like being like a story driven game and like a souls like, so, um, we just kind of scratched the surface last episode. We're going to dig a bit more into this today and really see what the game has to offer and uh, and go from there. But I hope everybody's having a great day today. All right, give it one sec. All right, we should be good. Um, sure. Tim, what's going on? How you doing? Caspi, what's up, brother? Welcome back. <clears throat> Oh, I forgot we got this awesome outfit last time. All right, so we got to go talk to Ryuma. Ah, it's you. So you're done for the night, are you? Ah, uh, Leoric Semper Five, brother, how you doing? Army gal, what's going on? Um, did you find out where... Yeah, let's see. No, it was a dead end. This is a place where people know things, but tonight I got nothing. How about you? Have fun? You have a habit of getting dragged into things, don't you? Oh. By the way, my night wasn't a total loss. Turns out I know the person who owns the longhouse nearby. Even Ronin like you need a place to sleep, right? I'll head over and procure a room. Come check it out later, won't you? All right. <laughs> Gotta get used to the controls again. Any romance in this game? Ah, uh, not that I've seen so far. Hey! There are relationships though, like you build bonds with characters in the game, and like depending on the bond level, like you get like better uh, skills and benefits and stuff it's like that. It's a little rundown, but pretty <laughs> spacious inside. You can keep a change of clothes or anything you'd like here. I hope you'll find it useful. No sticks and stones in this one, Casper. I'm sorry, brother. Get the banner up. Longhouse is now available. Uh, people with whom you have a bond with will visit you here. To strengthen your bond with such individuals, you might want to talk with them, try giving them gifts. Longhouse is a place where you can store items, add furniture, change your character's appearance, or change your appearance of your equipment. Uh, you can also do co-op from in here, too. Whoa, pre-order benefits you've received. Including the... Yo, that looks so cool. You know, it's not bad relaxing together like this. Quick combo so for me missed. This is cool as hell. Right, let's go. I want to try on stack. The one of them was like a Ninja out. What is that? Yo, that reminded me of the armor from one of the. Uh, it's pretty it, handy, right? I never played you can the use game. Use it how you like. 
I'll pop in every now and then. From now on, I'll tell everyone that this is where we're staying. I remember seeing that the. That should uh... make things a little livelier. Well, that's it for you and me tonight. But I'm going to keep searching for leads on Master Showin's location. Is it Ninja Gaiden? Come on, no need to get all polite. Think nothing of it. I know you've got my back too. Ah, oh, wait a second. I wanted to give you this. It's a pocket watch. Now you can check the time anytime. GG, bro. Hope you don't mind that it's slightly used. I think you'll still find it handy. Well, see you around. Okay, so let me mess around with this real quick. So we got... Different stances now. I don't know. Uh, we'll tr I think we're going to try out this one. Oh, yeah. See, I like that. Oh, that's some Rock Lee shit. So how do I actually select that though? Switch and up oh, there, but damn it. I think it was this one, right? Yeah. And then we'll have the... So you can have multiple different stances. So this one definitely gives a katana bonus. And same thing with this one. And then for the dual wield swords here, I don't have any other paired sword styles yet. Which is all good. Armor. Let's see where my uh. Oh, was that just an appearance? I wonder if that was just an appearance. That what we got. Let's go back in here and check really quick. Yeah. So I don't think you can actually wear this. Yeah, you can display it. You can display your weapons and shit, like your katanas. So let's go get this damn uh, camera. Now the job that the lady asked us to do is pretty lame and pretty easy. She just wants us to get a camera and take pictures of the place. Like that's not really a job for a samurai, but or a ronin, but we got it. 
Max, holy shit, thank you so much for the donation, man. Happy Monday, Brian and Chet. I'm a PC gamer, uh, so I got to get my PlayStation fixed through streamers. Hey, dude, I hear you on that, man. I was for the longest time. Um, We've heard reports you're making very dubious items in there. But I had I had to get a PlayStation for, like, Last Oi, of Us type things. Open this door! Right, let's see what this guy's going to... Oi. Oi, you. What are you doing here? You look shady to me. Out with it. Who are you? We're under strict orders from Lord E to arrest anyone suspicious. Uh, so I have no speechcraft at all. Um, we're gonna have to fight these dudes, which it is what it is. What the hell? Who do you think you are? You're out of line! It's time to teach you a lesson! How the hell did they attack me through that? Okay. Timing back down. was a big help. Ready? This is the one that I did bad on. Can I get $50 in Robux now? No. What? Then why's that lady running from me? Got a sandwich that I have? I just had a bologna with salami and American cheese with mayo and spicy brown mustard. 
I owe you. Those nitwits. They think cameras are some kind of weapon. I'd like to give you a demonstration. But I'm afraid my camera is broken. It means I can't earn a living. How is it, Igashichi? Got it working again? I'm afraid not. Without the schematic, I'm at the end of my rope. <laughs> Curse those dumped thieves. Are you serious? This isn't good. Those thags have no idea of the value of what they've stolen. But I can hardly just go and ask for them back. Uh, wait. Is that my glider prototype you have there? You managed to get it back from those thieves! Most impressive! Could it work? Uh, I don't know. Uh, uh, but it might! I can see it all in my head. The perfect plan. I need those schematics back. And if you help me, I'll give you a camera. Sound good? You said what? Is somebody learning the tuba in the background? What, in the game? I don't hear anything. Oh, that, no. That's, uh, that's the workers outside cutting, I think. Yeah, hold on one sec. I think they're outside cutting wood. Like, learning the tuba. So can you guys still hear me? You guys should still be able to hear me. It might be a little quieter to hear the, the tuba. I'm a bit quiet. I never use it in this piece. All right, what about now? Does that sound uh, better? We'll rock with this. This should still be pretty loud. And uh, it should cut out the tuba a little bit. Is this good? All right, let me see. A clear and rational response. You must have the inventors a spirit. Those thieves have a base in the Mitre Castle ruins, but we can't just stroll straight in. Head to the temple hall nearby. Oh dear! <laughs> I forgot to introduce myself. My name is Igashichi Izuka. Back home in Hitachi, I'm known as Igashichi the Tinkerer. Well, I shall see you there. Dear me. Seems he's fired up once again. Well, please do what you can to help him. Casper, what's going on? How you doing? 
These are ridiculous. Okay, so this is quite far away. The bad bunch. I don't know what these are, so on our way over, we can uh we can see what these are. This one's level four. This one is level four. Let's see what this is. On our way over. Will I be playing Helldivers 2 anytime soon? Um, well, I didn't know that people really wanted to see it like that. Like, the first couple episodes, the first episode did really, really well. The second episode did all right. Um, I don't know. I haven't, check, I haven't checked the stats on that. It kind of just seemed like, you know, people were interested to see what Helldivers was about. But I didn't know people oh, didn't really. How could this happen? Please, won't somebody help me? Didn't really come across as like a series, you know what I mean? Oh, nice. So you can collect resources right on the horse. Army Gal, thank you, thank you for dropping the gifted. Whoever receives that, welcome to the fam. Honest opinion on this game so far? It's okay. Um, I definitely wouldn't... I mean, it definitely feels a bit... Uh, stiff. I'd say the story is a bit stiff. Uh, you know what I've come to notice that I'm, I'm I'm not really a fan of anymore is silent protagonists. Like the when when the character you play with doesn't speak. Uh, I'm starting to like that less and less in games. I've started noticing over the past like year or so. Anyone with confidence in their martial skills? Should we ch kick this dude's ass? Or maybe it won't. I, I don't know. I feel like we should be able to serve this dude. I don't have any heals though. I sh ah, excellent timing, my friend. Someone you know has just become my pupil, you see. Tim, Would thank you, you care for the to five, give them dude. a lesson? Thank you for the five gifted, man. All right, let's do it. Are you ready? Hemp. Begin. Wait, is this another player? Hemp. Pe let's begin. of my sex how you handled my pupils attacks and threw him off balance was truly impressive yeah cause you know I was whooping his ass chat I wasn't even worried about it no man holy crap thank you for the donation man thanks for the constant honesty and great community I really appreciate you brother I appreciate you being here No, it wasn't the horse. It was my character dumbass jumped on the horse. Oh, it looks like Yeah. 
Of course it's good. My dude just started jumping on it. Let's see, how far do we get? <laughs> Not right now, Wolf. I'm trying to do this mission. I probably should try to find a... A banner location that way if I do that way I can reset my uh to kill this dude? No. Just, it's just an I was about to kill him, but... Tursen. He needs to be taught a lesson. Hey, you. You look like trouble. You might be just who I'm looking for. Rough someone up for me, and I'll make it worth your while. You interested? There's this real piece of work who swindled me out of some money. I saw him hanging around the waste ground up ahead. Come on, go and rough him up, will you? I'll make it worth your while. Much obliged. I knew you wouldn't let me down. <laughs> it seems shady. Oh, it's up this way. I mean, yeah, he already has a weapon. I don't understand why he doesn't do it. Will with the super chat, brother. Game got a different uh, vibe. Kingdom Come Deliverance. You think it has like a Kingdom Come? I don't know. Kingdom Come was like a... That had a really, really unique feel to it. Oh, okay. This dude... I don't even know what kind of weapon that is on his back. You! Some kind of pole arm? What the hell are you doing here? Huh? Oh, for. Got it all wrong. It isn't my fault. I'm innocent. I tell you. That's why you let me go before. Oh, it's him. Or is it? You had a reason for letting me live. This was Gonzo, the boss that so we let him live. Why not team up with me? I, I promise. You won't regret it. <laughs> oh, that's great. After all, we are old friends by now. Let's do this. Yeah, so this is the this is the same guy that we let go in our first mission. Um, 
he was like the leader of a bandit tribe and uh, I spared his life. There's more guys here now. to be beaten by that pitiful wretch. Even still, you are incredible! Where'd you learn to fight like that? Give me a shout if something big comes along, or come frying. You can count on it. We got a new bond? Yep. Nice, so we got another bond. And that, that that was a character that you could have killed too. Public order mission here. We'll clear out. I think these are like little outposts or whatnot. Will with another super chat. Sorry, Yo, that that was like that was the thing for for me, Will, with uh, Kingdom Come. It really was like. Uh, Probably one of the closest things that you'll get to like a first person like medieval simulator. Like, you know, you simulate living in the middle medieval times. It was really cool though. I really, really enjoyed it. Didn't you guys say that there was talk of there being like a sequel to Kingdom Come Deliverance? Could you imagine them like remake or, or making like an up-to-date version of that game? Of course, proper sequel. But like, I think that shit would be dope as hell. Let <laughs> me get my bow and arrow back out. Actually, oh yeah, this bow is actually better. Oh. 
Powerful enemy. Sorry for the trouble. Are there any future games you're looking forward to? Uh, Nomad, it's hard, man, because um, I was looking forward to like Dragon Dogma, but for, 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 like I guess you could say probably the next game, the next big game I'm really looking forward to this year would probably be um, the Ubisoft Star Wars game, um, Outlaws or whatever. A lot of gear that we could check out right now. Welcome. Fugitives uh, from the laws are gonna uh, can be found throughout the land. You can revive uh, fugitive location or review fugitive location, defeat fugitives to receive rewards from the government officials. Okay. Um. Let's see what we got from equipment here. Um, so these are actually better. These paired swords here. These are those huge, huge, like, weapons. Uh, 
Um, this is only an equipment level two, and it's almost as good as this equipment level nine. Uh, this does have some pretty decent stats, but this is still pretty good. This has overall more damage, but this one's still better. In some way. I think we might be able to upgrade this sword, though, to make it, like, the level go up on it. I, we'd have to check it, though. And we just got a new bow. that ninja outfit honestly the stats on it aren't that great like the defense stats on this are ridiculous we're talking 70 extra defense I think I have two pieces, yeah, from the Eagle Eye Archer set now. And what's the two piece bonus? Oh, I don't think there is one. Yeah, we really, this really looks like an outfit from Ghost of Tsushima, though, for real. Alright, so let's see. Let's check the map here. We got that area cleared out. Let's keep riding. I don't think they stole it from Ghost of Tsushima. I just think it's just a time period thing, you know what I mean? And that's just what the hat looked like. Public order level 8 over here. That's a really, really one of us. Be careful entering combat with them as you'll be in for a hard fight. So I won't even be able to kill that guy. It's 11 enemies there. Four of them are formidable. Area that guy wanted me to go to for the camera. I don't think this was it. Maybe it was, because that was the main quest. <laughs> yep, this is over it. here, my friend. Let's see where he wants us to attack. Ah, there you are. Now listen up. Here's the plan. Those bandits are holed up in the castle. If we march straight up to the front door, it would be suicide. Luckily, we can use my prototype to glide in from here. 
Once you are in there, you simply need to retrieve my blueprints. Shall we get started? Are you ready to take to the skies? Marvelous! Now, just to relax. I've never tested it, but the science behind it is impeccable. I'm afraid I can't come to your aid if you are apprehended, but I'm sure you'll be fine. Best of luck. Okay, here we go. So I can pick um, my allies, and it looks like I can actually go in with two different allies. So we'll bring both Gonzo and uh, Ryoma. Equipment's good. I'm ready for action. All right. right, let's take a stroll. Got ourselves the American rifle. A little stronger than the one we currently have. That dude walking like he has to take a fat shit. got some pretty good gear off that guy.
here! Who the hell are you? Trying to steal my treasure, are you? Ewood with the super chat. Thank you so much. How are you doing today? I'm doing good today. Doing good today. The game's all right. The game's pretty decent. It's, uh... I don't feel like it's next gen by any means. Uh, like, my honest opinion, I don't feel like it's a next gen. I could not consider it next gen. So does it not make you, when you lose, you don't have to refight the formidable dudes? Oh, 
Fight the stupid fire, we parrying them. If you jump off the tower, uh, I'm calling out for a month, right? <laughs> Will, thank you, thank you for the super chat, brother. Shit, I'm not, I'm not going back. I'm not, there's no calling out for a month. I'm not going back.
decorative rifle. Let me see. We got some good gear there. Yeah. Oh, look at this one. This hits hard. It's a really, really good rifle. Items. Come on, over here. So there's there was one more boss here. So he was spotted by the bandits, formidable. but still managed to prevail. Magnificent. I saw those wretches fleeing for their lives. Oh, my blueprint! Thank you! I was worried that those delinquents might have disposed of them. Now I'll finally be able to show the studio now what I can do. Here's the prototype I promised you. Take it. Hold on, hold on. Make sure you use it, you hear? Your banter sound all around you. Now, I believe there's an elevated area in these grounds. Why not try taking a picture? This game there? is fully open Follow world me. fallout. This so way, the camera. Me. Yeah, all this for a damn camera. This used to be a fine castle where the lords of Kira resided. But his best days are now behind it. Over here. Very well. It's time to give that camera a go. Don't be shy. Ah! I know! The temple hall where we met is the perfect spot for a photograph. I'm glad to see you like my camera. Impressive, no? And this is just the beginning. There are so many improvements I want to make. Ah, speaking of which, I must go. I have a camera I need to fix. <laughs> the fellow who runs that place has a temper, you see. Anyway, I'll be in Yokohama for a while. It's the place to be for anyone keen to learn more about foreign ideas and inventions. Remember, it's not just cameras, I double Face double seven, what's going if on? I can assist you in some way. Just let me know. Wonderful. I would be delighted to help. And I have a feeling you will put my devices to good use. I'm lodging in the photographic studio in Yokohama for the time being. Feel free to come and see me anytime. There are all sorts of improvements I want to make to that camera. So don't be a stranger, you hear? Hold on one sec, guys. So now we now I think you can fast travel to these, right? 
Yeah. So the little banners that you set up, you can fast travel to them. What is my biggest culinary? Uh, I don't even know what that means. Oh, like, regardless of the hate, weird looks, family. Um, mm, foods that I like. Uh, like, some of the things that I absolutely love that, like, the wife is, like, grossed out by. Would mainly be like pork and beans and hot dogs. I, I I think pork and beans and hot dogs is like a top tier food. It's just delicious. Pork and beans with hot dogs is pretty normal. This, that's what I felt. I felt like that was pretty normal. Or, uh... Well, I see you've acquired a camera. I knew I could rely on you. Now, if I may, I would like to ask you to take some photographs for me. Or like, um, fried bologna sandwich with cheese. Mm. If you know, you know, chat. Fried bologna sandwich. Hey, it's different. Huh? Then I shall direct you to a number of rooms. Just take everything Be out sure of to capture the sheer the energy of this so place. Pour, put it in here. I will await you in the central room upstairs. So we got to photograph the servants' quarters. The owner says she saw a woman in a purple sash going up. To she must be losing her marbles. Him again. I don't care about his flower. How important he is. <laughs> oh dear. Wait, does she got me blackmailing? She got me blackmailing people? We were just talking. I promise. My mistress paid me to speak to him. She played it off as if she wanted us to go around taking pictures of the building, but she really got us in here blackmail. This is the first instance of uh, someone using a camera to blackmail a politician. I'm trying to think of like the oh something weird that I eat. That, people would consider weird but i feel like i'm exactly in other words it's like this yeah bro I don't know how, do we gotta go up another floor? Cause it makes no sense. But these rooms don't exist. Okay, maybe this one is over here. No, look, there's fucking a wall, dude. 
So that's that one room and then the other one's... Maybe we gotta go up. I think this might be the top floor, chat. Oh, okay. Yeah, we gotta do it from the window. You have the goods, but there seem to be more than usual. Well, I've built up a stockpile. I thought you might appreciate a little extra. Hey, <laughs> this isn't good. If I get caught with all this, I'm in real trouble. Oh, don't be like that. Mm. Times are hard. You need all the money you can get, right? Yeah, she definitely got us in here, Black Melon Jet. Cool with it. Wow, it's just a scale on the outside here, but I don't see anywhere to climb up. <sighs> Vents, dude. Look, I'll have the money very soon. Then I'll pay up, and you and me can, you know. Selling some goods that this country is very short of. Next week, my ship will bring more supplies, then I will be set. But remember, you're not my only client. I cannot simply abandon them, you know? Sure, you'll need a week or so to tie up loose ends. Wait, I know. Why don't you sail back with me? What? You would take me to France? <sighs> that doesn't sound bad. Right? <laughs> uh, I can't wait to see the look on my mother's face. So <laughs> you <clears throat> I have not watched that yet. Not yet, Cass. We have been trying to really, really chew through One Piece over the past few. Lost the internet. Oh, mine's good. 
Oh my, you work fast. <laughs> you certainly know your way with a camera. Now, finally, I want you to go to the room down the hall. You will find a man named Kogoro Katsura there. He's rather intimidating, but I'm sure you can handle him. Just make sure he doesn't notice you. Did you get your picture? Huh? Who are you? Come to the garden now. Wait, this guy has. Admit it. You're a spy for the Shogunate. I'll cut you down. Is he using that drunken style?
God damn, dude. <laughs> well, his movements are out so weird. Exactly. It's just like that. I so couldn't believe it. How are we going to get that Harris? If you have any ideas, speak up. The consulate is very well guarded. We can't attack from the front. Well, how about a diversion? We start the scuffle at the front. I'm about to unleash my most deadly technique. Uh. Well, well, look who it is. What uh, are you doing out here? Nothing important. Ah, oh no, did Katsura pick a fight with you? So you know him? Oh, I know him, all right. This is the guy who's been helping me look for Master Shoin. Katsura here is an old student and close friend of his. <laughs> this guy never learns. Just the other night, he got dead drunk and danced around naked before falling into a pond. Oh. <sighs> I'm sorry. I had an important matter to look into. Look to the drinks! Look around on me! <laughs> Wait, like, I never understood getting that drunk. Like, I've probably been that drunk maybe like twice.
ever in my life, Chet. And the second time was so bad, I had alcohol poisoning and I was on an IV. And it literally felt like shit for like three days. I never did it again. Never understood how people could get that drunk just consistently. That's like I made a mistake and I accidentally got that drunk. <laughs> I came to see what all the fuss was about, but I see it was you and Mr. Katsura. Would you join me in my chambers? There is something I wish to share with you. Thanks, dedication and practice. I can never. Oh, I just feel too thank crappy. You. What a wonderful picture. I can almost feel the life of this place. Now, where were we? Oh, yes. The samurai who came aboard a black ship. When I last visited the American consulate, I heard an interesting tidbit. Apparently, that samurai is within the consulate itself. They say that samurai has a hand like a demon's claw and acts as Mr. Harris's personal guard. I cannot imagine. It certainly doesn't sound natural. Now I think of it, Kichi is on rather good terms with Mr. Harris. It may be worth speaking to her later. You take splendid pictures. You can stand up to Katsura. Is there anything you can't do? While I do still have some requests for you, for tonight, please enjoy your time here. We got her as a. We established a bond with her too. Ah! This is my first base. Your base will serve as a meeting place for various. Oh, so we we got this place as a base. We got the longhouse as a base. Oh, heading home, are you? I heard you're looking for someone who came on the black ships. Taka told me. So, did you find out anything? There you go. See, I told you this was the place to come. And there's more. I know there was that incident, but Katsura's a fellow worth knowing. He might well need your help with this and that. I recommend staying on his good side. I'll warrant his head's cleared by now, so maybe you should pay him a visit. He's staying at the Sakura Inn. Head there now and you'll catch him. I bet he can help you find whoever it is you're looking for. I'm going to keep searching for Master Shoin. Once I find him, I'll introduce you. I promise. You and I are true friends now, no doubt about it. If you're ever in trouble, just let me know. So we did get a new set of paired swords. You have a piece of equipment you like, but on a useful level, consider upgrading it. We're such a low level right now. We're getting consistent gear, so it's like I don't want to keep... Yeah, like we got these right here. They're pretty decent paired swords. So we got a mission here. We do have a public order right here. That's quite a low level. Let's go knock that one out real quick. Blake with the three months. How you doing? Let 
Kirk, do you have her weapon? So there's only one formidable in here. I want to try out this rifle. Hey, 
this. He's unlocked a new weapon in combat style, the ox tail blade, I think it was called. Let's do the pole arm swing psych. Said, I, that's a, my main gripe with the game, guys, is it just doesn't feel like a game that would come out in 2024. Like, even when you just, like, look at, like, the map, the textures and stuff like that, it just seems... I don't know, does it, does it mean or does it seem... It just seems dated. I don't know. Like, you look at a game like, like something like Ghost of Tsushima that came out so many years prior to this, and it, it feels like it's, you know, 10 years tech-wise ahead of a game like this. There are parts of the combat that are really, really fun. Uh, haven't we met somewhere? Ah, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, uh -huh. ah, I was sure you were a spy for the Shogun, but it turned out you were a Throma. Sorry about all that. My memory is pretty hazy. My. Had a few too many again, did you? Sadly, yes. And I ended up getting soundly beaten by our friend here. To be honest, I might have struggled even stone cold sober. Your skill with the sword is quite something, but you seem to be self-taught. I recommend you test your metal at a proper dojo. Genzui here is off to do just that. And he's no slouch when it comes to his studies either. No wonder he's showing Yoshida's favorite. <laughs> this accursed city is full of outsiders acting like they own the place. Reason that looked Removing crazy them from good, our dude. land calls for force, not diplomacy. Now is the time to show the world the tenacity of our blades. In the name of this divine country. <sighs> yeah, he goes again. I'm going gambling. I've been not a short on coin of late. Where are your manners, Shinsaku? Show our guests some courtesy. Want to join me? You seem like a lucky sort. I get the feeling you survived a few scrapes you shouldn't have. Caspi, dude, you need to check out... If you didn't check out the stream last night, man, just kind of give it a peek, the uh, Horizon Forbidden West stream. And dude, look at, just check out the graphics, man. Um, it just released on PC. Dude, I'm not gonna lie, man. It's probably one of the, it, like, it's probably one of the best looking video games I've seen in a long, I, 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 it's probably the, to date, probably one of the top, within the top five best looking video games of all time right now. Uh, it, it looks that good.
Like I, I would even say it's it's graphically better than even like Red Dead Redemption 2. By a lot. It, it was just it was it was gorgeous, man. It was so good. We got another public. This one's ooh, hold on. This one was level eight, wasn't it? Yeah, it's level eight. You know that show keep yapping about the night game. Uh, did my research and for a 2015 game. Oh uh, no! So yeah, Jay, no, listen, I, I just I just bust his balls because he busts mine. Um, I I actually went and looked at the trailer for Arkham Knight myself, and I was like, God damn, um, it actually does look really good graphically for being as old as it is. Now, it, obviously, it doesn't compete with like some of the more modern games but i definitely say it's it's up there graphics wise hell yeah it's probably within the from what i've seen from that trailer if that's what the game actually looks like when i get in it i would definitely say that game's probably in the within the probably the top 10 top 15 best looking video games to date easily yeah for especially being for like, as old as it is i was like Get out of here, dude. It really is. It is a beautiful game. Did I mark this one? Yep. Okay, cool. Right now. Oh, okay, so you can't hit him. 
We actually got two pieces of gear there that were upgrades. Hold on a sec, guys. Uh. All right, so this is a pretty big upgrade. Oh, nice. We actually got two upgrades here. We still have not replaced this damn uh, hat, though, that we got. Oh, no, that's a level 10. That's a level 8. Do this black uh, yeah we'll do this I swear I hit one of these I definitely didn't okay So we can clear these public orders down here. These two are, this one's a level eight. This was that scary one. I don't know if we're going to mess with that. We'll try it. See how it works. Then we got this one here and then we'll do this, uh, the black jewel quest here. Rescue the horse. I think that was a small activity. Yes, but that one was a. Uh, 
let's mark this just so we know where to go. These public orders actually do give some pretty good gear. Uh, what game looks better graphically? Red Dead Redemption 2 or The Last of uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, the Last of Us looks good. Um, but you got to remember, it's not an open world game. So you got to think, Red Dead Redemption 2 is putting out all those graphics, all those amazing textures and the, uh, the AI and the facial feet and all that stuff. And it's in a complete open world where the, where, uh, the Last of Us is a linear game. So they can make the game look really, really pretty because they only have to load so many assets at a time, you know what I mean? Compared to Red Dead, which is this huge, huge open world, you know? Um, but they both are really good looking games for sure. Uh, but yeah, Red Dead Redemption 2 would probably get the, uh, for me personally, because it, yeah, just the, and you're also, I'm also talking PC because Red Last of Us, um, well, they did do the remake um, on PC, and it does look phenomenal. But yeah, I'd say it's 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 probably on par with um, Red Dead. I wouldn't say it's any better though. What about Red Dead Ghost? I mean, Forbidden West looks better than uh, the one we played yesterday that's the, probably one of the best looking games i've seen um next to like cyberpunk because i think cyberpunk's an extremely phenomenal looking game especially when you crank it oh my god cyberpunk looks unreal um yeah i would definitely say that uh forbidden west is on a whole nother level than those games That's a formidable. That's a leader. Damn, I don't want to fight both these guys at the same time. That's going to suck. There's 11 enemies here. And four of them are formidable enemies, so... headband that's actually better finally got a new headpiece to it. not that i don't mind the uh master strategist bolster karma loss additional item drop what the fuck is that string real
formidable. I didn't even realize how low my health was. Was that? So did that board literally just Sorry for the trouble. What combat style am I using for the dual build? What I only have one so far, and I think it's uh, what the hell was the name of it? This one here, the Mu Mumyo Ruyo. It's the only one I have for part paired swords currently. I have a bunch for katana, but yeah, only one for paired swords right now.
Guess it would be pretty hard to stealth kill a wolf, right? I've played only a little bit of Sekiro. I do plan on checking it out at some point. The gentleman's suit does look pretty dope. I need to get some more of those. Yeah, I don't know how to get more. Of the, I'm pretty sure you just got to find them. Uh, but yeah, we got plenty of katana styles, but like no styles for the, the paired swords yet. We got a ton of skill points, so we should have been spending these. This probably would have helped out a bunch. Dexterity.
We could start putting some in the charm too. Combine uh, naval allies, crit, increase enemy coin act. So we need charm charisma points for that, not skill points. That's completely different. This actually makes a rifle better. Go see. I want to see if we hit any harder with the rifle. Oh shit! I think we weren't Arthur Morgan. That would have been it. Huh? This is what AC Red's gonna be. I highly. This is like a Souls like. I'd hope that the Assassin Creed game that they uh, wouldn't be anything like this. We actually just did big damage with the rifle right that was kind of crazy what the hell is this dude it's got no chill see how the enemies are all aggro based Easy. Gucci! What's going on? Thank you so much for the super chat. Um, also, when we get another uh, opening stream, I'm addicted to this thing. <laughs> um, I, I don't know. I don't really have... The, the thing is with the opening streams, every time I do one of those, I have to spend like significant amount of money, you know, to have something to open. Um, and right now we just don't really have anything to open. I did open another box, um, um off stream. Um, didn't get anything out of it, really. But yeah, that's the only issue with the opening streams. And then it's not like the viewership on, viewerships on them is all that high, so there's not even, like, a return on investment. Like, where if I go and I buy a $60 video game, you know what I mean, and then I do a live stream of it, and I make at least thirty, forty dollars. You know what I mean. I can pay off, or, or sometimes I'll even make the full sixty dollars back. You know what I mean. I can kind of 
get the return on investment and pay the game off. But when I do those opening streams, if I buy one of those boxes for 100 bucks, I might get lucky and make 15 $10, if that, um, on that stream. So it's just kind of like money just actually disappears. It's the hardest part about them. A lot of guys that you see do the opening streams, the way that they facilitate like doing so many of them is they do buy-ins. So what that means is they'll buy a box. Um, you know, they'll buy a box that has 36 packs of cards in it. And then what they do is they sell them to their viewers. So like the viewers can come buy packs. And then what I would do is I would open them on stream and then, you know, then I would mail you your cards. So I would, I would open your cards on stream, we'd, you know, oh, cool. But then I, at the end of the stream, I'd package them all up and then I would mail them out to whoever paid for them. Um, and that's how most of those guys do it, because if, if not, um, yeah, you know, I just buy the cards and then the money's just spent. <clears throat> so we got the black jewel quest up there so why does it still say this one is locked oh so after i clear out the area i need to go back and actually hit the damn no this is in a different spot i think Uh, didn't one guy just break a first edition base box one of the viewers paid for it. yeah and he pulled the first edition Charizard yeah, yeah uh, poke rev yeah that's what he that's what those guys do so yeah he he um, he had viewers buying in those packs for like sixty five hundred dollars a piece though um, yeah he had guys buy in and then he uh, opened it and then mailed them out so yeah, so now we're good. Oh boy, you have a good rest of your day, all right? Get that good sleep. Oh yeah, the, I think one of the, the yeah, the bigger one of the biggest um, guys on on the platform is uh Pokerev, yeah. However good your gun, you might as well be wielding a club if you can't hit anything. How about a bit of training? Uh so do we get stat from this? All right. Let's see what you've got. Complete for points by destroying targets within the time limit. Shots will penetrate through wooden targets, but not metal targets. Okay. Um, all right, let's see how we do. I don't think I'll do that great because I'm going to... Good. You're quite the shot, huh? Consider me impressed. Oh, so I at least got the level one prize. Oh, we got the level two prize, too. However good your gun, you might as well be wielding a club if you... Yeah, I'm on the controller, Caspi, unfortunately. All right. Let oh, I did all of them. Guys, I got... I, I unlocked the full thing. Oh, I didn't even realize it. Yeah, so we maxed it out already. I didn't even... It's weird.
Yeah, I didn't I didn't even realize that we did that good. Uh, Cassie, I think the only reason my aim has gotten even remotely decent on the controller is because we um we've been playing a lot of controller games over the past few like months. So I feel like my thumbs are starting to work properly. <laughs> but uh yeah, generally you know how it is, dude. It's 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 rough. It's rough out here. So with the black jewel, um stolen statue. What is this one? Horse rescue. That's a low level too. And then this is the main quest here. Yeah, so we got we got black jewel which will knock out and then we could get back on the main men missions but um we'll pick that up next time guys so i, I want to get three streams in today so that's why i'm cutting these all a little bit short so we can kind of get uh all of them in but i do appreciate you guys again for coming and hanging out i'm gonna go eat some food real quick and then we'll be doing uh one more stream today uh it's it's been amazing i really appreciate the support that you guys have been showing remember if you guys do want to see more of this a smash that like button uh consider subscribing to the channel it helps out so much drop a comment down below after the stream's over let me know what you guys thought um what's next i i'm not sure i was gonna i was gonna give it a go and see about checking out um alone in the dark but from the other character perspective so i was gonna try that out um and and, and kind of see how that goes and Cause it seemed like people enjoyed the first couple episodes. So I was like, Oh, maybe we could check out the other characters. See how we, we uh, so we'll, we'll see. I don't know if the game, I got to do a little, does that, can anybody tell me, is the game like different enough to play both characters or is it not really different? Cause I don't want to like replay the whole thing. If it's just like a couple small differences, I want to make sure that it's like, you know, Claire Leon type different. It's the same. It's not that different. Oh, okay. Well, I appreciate you guys for uh for making that known. Yeah, because we would have wasted. Yeah, we would we would have wasted a lot of time with that. All right. So then we'll uh I'll have to figure out something else. But all right, guys. Thank you again. Appreciate the love and support. Remember, if you guys haven't smashed that like button. If I don't see you guys in the next stream, which I don't know what we're playing now, um, you have a great rest of your night. And for everybody else, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.